Tommy Johansson. This is probably one of the most popular ones that he's done so far. Um, it's a high standard, so I'm pretty curious what it's what he's going to bring to the table. Let's check it out. Uh, Marina, let me know how the sound is of the video compared to my voice. It should be okay, but I'm not sure. Here we go. Is this the real life? Is this just fantasy? Caught in a landslide, no escape from reality. Okay, so what we hear with Tommy Johansson here, I feel like it's v like more precisely um, edged out all the notes. There's not too much runs through it. It's like there's, it's clean, but it's just clean to the next note every time. I don't know what it what it's called, but there's no like notes in between or going up to a note or going down from a note no escape from reality yeah like a, for example escape from reality you could go like escape from reality for example uh, but he do he does it like this escape from reality that's the difference no escape from reality Open your eyes Look up to the skies and see I'm just a poor boy I need no sympathy Because I'm easy come, easy go Little high, little low Okay, so... What we hear in the original, Tommy didn't do this, but I mean, doesn't really matter. In the original, when they sing little high, little low, you also hear it like up down there and uh, down low, down below. Here we don't have that. But the choirs that he does, like the, the voices that he does, are basically exactly the same as the original. Okay, so there's a bit of an effect on the piano too, on the keyboard, that we don't have. In the original, it's almost purely piano, uh, but here we have some, it's like an octave higher. We have some like bell kind of sound that we have, uh, some little bit, a little bit of strings there too, uh, but it's okay. I'm curious how we will make it different. Uh, I don't know if he he is going to make this rougher, uh, harder, by using guitar, but I guess we'll find out. Like I thought, there is some guitar subtly coming in, in the background with some kind of riff. Uh, it's only on the left side that I hear it. And there's also more strings coming in, a bit more percussion. <laughs> Here 
go. Oh, that sounds nice with the chords on the guitar there. Plus, a difference that we hear right now too is that it changed from black and white to color. I don't know why that decision, but it's something that I noticed. Uh, Ida, he added some little things to make it his own, yet didn't take it too far. Kept faithful to the original. Yeah, it's always risky to go too far from the original um, with songs like this, I think. Let me return so that we have the transition. The guitar joins in. I bend up there. Woo. Oh, so we have a double run in here from the guitars. Just this little part in between. The bends are so nice to listen to. Here. It's double. Nice end there. I see a little silhouette of a man. I think that is hard to cover, like the timing of that. Magnifico! Because you have these multiple layers. It's, it's hard to keep timing there, I think. Always have been. Uh, in this song um, in a certain part we heard him use like more space have a more like all uh, sound um, there more hollow I would say he says here Gal Gal Galileo whilst I think in the original it's Galileo and not Galileo, Galileo, Galileo. So that's a bit different. It's subtle. You wouldn't really notice it if you don't really pay attention, but. The last one it is like that. I'm just a poor boy, nobody loves me. Nice Easy that the guitar joined in there. Extra kick there. Okay, so there are a couple of subtle differences in there. Like Marina said, indeed, uh, it's 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 not it's cool to try and pick them out I think there is a part missing here no Yeah, he does normally like, I'm just a poor boy, nobody loves me. That's not it. Yeah, it's not in there. Oh, that high voice is just incredible. But that's a part that they that he didn't include there. I'm just a poor boy, nobody loves me. Oh, 
upper one there here. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> that was nice. <laughs> Our colors changed again. I like the multiple voice layers and the end there with the strings. What a cover. Yeah, really good. Really good. It's 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 not too far from the original, like you said, Marina. But still, the twists, the the, the changes that he makes are really nice. Really love that. I think it's going to be probably one of his more popular ones. Um. It's 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 not the most impressive uh one that he has, but there are some crazy parts in this too, though. I think. What is my favorite one from Tommy Johansson? I think it might be Thunderstruck. Might be. There are some couple other really good ones though. 